What did you think? <laughs> What a story, Paul. <laughs> That's a great Tommy Wiseau. Way better than your Al P F F F Fail Pacino. Oh, right, 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 you mean right, right. your Fail Pacino? Fail Pacino. Yeah. <laughs> This is FFPU, your primary source for Austrian film and TV critique, where two minds come together to take apart the work of people who actually matter. Welcome back to the latest episode of FFP. My name is Paul and this is the 30th of March 2018 and we are recording the 74th episode of FFP. and he is here for the first time, Comrade Dennis Nicolin. Hey Dennis, thank you for being here, man. Thank you for, for, for joining the podcast. Well, thank you for having me tonight. Yes, it, it, it has been quite an exciting day of a lot of sharing and caring for each other. Yeah. Was it? Yes, I think so. Yeah, you, you were supposed to turn up at 10 in the morning and you mm. couldn't. And then I said, I'm, sh I'm caring for you. You can come later. And hey, now it's midnight. <laughs> well, yes. Technically, but we're recording on the 31st already. But, 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 but come on, Paul. Yeah. I mean, uh, in the morning, I was uh, looking for the things to occupy. So Yeah. <laughs> All right. So um, we watched Enemy at the Gates. Oh, yeah, we did. The 2001 Jude Law mm -hmm. uh, movie, oh. Vehicle of sorts his his yeah. his private ryan moment oh yeah basically yeah at the sun and yeah let's 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 dive right into it let's dive into plot, B -b 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 -plot. So, oh first of all the the austrian connection of course is uh the woman that whose name I forgot to pull out again to, to check on. That's the third time yeah. he forgets yeah, her name. Yeah, I'm so bad with names. It's horrible. Like, What's my name? Uh, Dennis Nicolin. Okay. That's only because I, I, I remember your name through like a, a mental help. And it's uh, um, Nicolin is very close to nicotine. So I'm just Dennis Nicotine. And you you are smoking quite a lot, so Dennis Nicotine does 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 nail it actually. <laughs> that 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 stayed with me for quite a while. But I thought that we know each other from that uh, hotline. You actually called me when you tried to commit suicide. <laughs> and I say, Don't, yes. don't. Socialism yes. is coming. Yes, yeah, sorry. Don't worry. Don't worry. There there's not gonna be a you. It's only gonna be us from now on. Yes. Um, thank you, com the com good. Com uh, comrade Nicolin. Mm -hmm. um, so, the Sophie Roy Royce, 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 Sophie Royce, who's born in Upper yeah. Austria, is one of the characters, and she also dies really fast. Oh uh, wait! Should we warn about the spoilers? If we're gonna oh, talk that, spoilers no, no, about that, that movie? Everybody knows already that that uh. this is this is all. Dude, it's a movie from 2001. Come on, if you haven't watched it yet, watch Dude, the movie. Dude, what, what, what if someone listens to you like who was born in 2002 or 2003? They probably haven't never watched it. According to Google statistics, that's like 8% of my listenership. So, uh, fuck those guys. <laughs> um, yet, I mean. Okay, anyhow, spoilers. Yes, but before, spoilers ahead. But before yep. we start talking about the plot, I just want to point out that... like. I thought that I watched the movie. Yeah. Like, but. Uh, when you were a kid? Yeah. yeah, when I was a kid. But I, I recalled, and this is a p p pretty pretty weird, that uh, I never actually uh, finished the movie, like, because we were watching it with my uh, parents, uh, like, at our, at our countryside yeah. and stuff. And, like, we were watching until oh, the moment. For the listeners that don't know, Dennis is Russian. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm from Moscow, yeah. Yeah, if you haven't picked it up from the accent yet, he is 100% purebred Russian. Hey, my accent is not that Russian. Come on, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> no, it's not offensive Russian. It's just educated Russian. Let's say Eastern European yes. accent, okay? Okay, yes. okay, okay. Right. okay. I mean, technically, we are Eastern European too as Austrians, so... <laughs> we always say middle european but tech that would be us and switzerland and mm. let's be honest 
I rather be with the Eastern European than just with the Swiss. Come on, Ljubljana <laughs> is like next to you, so. Huh? Ljubljana is next to you. Yeah, Funny. exactly. So. Yeah, yeah. It's like right around the corner. Like, you know, it's all the shit we used to own. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Hungarian joke. Anyhow, uh, not only a Hungarian joke, also a Polish joke, a Czechoslovakian joke, a Serbian joke, a I Romanian mean, joke. Uh, come on, man. I mean, like... Parts I, of Italy joke. <laughs> a lot of jokes there. A lot of parts, a lot of jokes. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it, that, that's also the title of the official Austrian-Hungarian <laughs> Empire's <laughs> motto. <laughs> yeah, a lot of parts. A lot of parts, a lot of jokes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> The best practical one was World War One, but oh anyhow. yeah, that hey dude, that <laughs> he just shot him in the head and he's just like, no, it's just a prank, bro. <laughs> Ashton Ashton von Kutcher like jumped out of yeah, the yeah. like pranked. pranked. <laughs> yeah, back in the days when oh that nobody will get that the the pr a prank reference nowadays. Oh come on, I mean like that has every, been every, on, every, hasn't been on air since what two thousand six, right? But we watched it in Russia in 2009. Oh, yeah, because you got it late. Delayed, yeah. yeah. I mean, the signal on the internet was still, Pranks, was still bro. bad. Prank, <laughs> You thought you had internet. Ha, yeah. ha. All right, back to the story. Sorry. Yes. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah let's, uh, let's mm -hmm. dive into the plot. So, wait, wait, wait. I, yeah. I haven't yeah. I haven't finished. I, haven't, I didn't finish the movie. Why? Because, yeah. like, we're watching with my parents. And, like, when we got to the part uh, with the kid introduced... Uh, when the Jude Law's character yes. introduced to this kid's character, my parents went like, oh, for fuck's sake, they brought a kid? Yeah, is it going to be another Hollywood bullshit? Yeah. You know, like, it's just, did he need a kid? Oh, fuck this shit. And they switched it off. And I was like, okay, that's a bad movie. And I actually, like, when I watched it fully, it's not that, is that bad is that, like, is that like uh, people who are getting angry when they introduce a dog to a story and they're like, ah, fuck this. They're gonna, no, 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 no. They're going to either kill it, the no, no, dog no. or not kill the it, dog. No, no, no. It was a period of a hard is, depression no. after watching Phantom Menace. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. yes. And AI as well, so... Oh, that's a... Yeah, that's a double whammy of bad kids in bad... Bad kid actors... Double whammy. Bad kid actors in... In greatly hyped movies that then totally fucked even though themselves. Jack, even though Jack Lloyd was all right in uh, uh, Christmas Present, uh, Christmas uh, with Arnold Schwarzenegger. What oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Word? The the <laughs> what was the name? Uh, no, wait, wait, wait. Uh, I should know this as an Austrian. I should know them by yeah, heart. you should know. You should, should know the date. The movie. I, I should know all my my complete filmography. You know. I, I, I tried to cover actually the, the fucking Hercules in New York movie, but it's it's so terribly it's too bad. It's, it's too so bad. bad. Yeah, this is my early days. You, you get a brain aneurysm just watching it, you know. Just watch Conan. That was my first good movie. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Or Twins. Just twi Twins over and over again. Oh, Twins. Twins. Ah, amazing. Danny it's Vita. twice as good as any other movie I yeah, did. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Uh, it's excellent to have a, an, another Arnold uh, uh, impersonator on the on the. Thank FFL you for grounds. having me. Yeah, <laughs> it's uh, no problem. You know, you're welcome. Of course, it's, I'm welcome. Yeah, 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 refugees welcome from Russia. <laughs> Arnold from Russia wouldn't sound like that. I uh, actually that was my second pick after this movie would have been we should have watched Heat. we oh, we should have watched Red Heat yeah yeah it's cocaine cocaine an Austrian playing a Russian in an American movie is I think the pinnacle of oh everybody who's racist is stupid because this is already like uh, I have to correct you Austrian American yeah Duh. wait no he, he's not yeah well because he has the citizenship nowadays no this like since now it the is 80s, like now I he's think, Austrian American I think since the 80s. and people think he's Australian for some reason because of oh, the weird fuck accent that. fuck those guys <laughs> yeah. Anyhow, nobody, nobody would conquer uh, conquer um, um, Arnie's outback, you know, because he shot that kind of gay movie at the beginning of his bodybuilder career. Okay, whatever. You're confusing him with Sylvester Stallone, I think, no? Um, no, the, the, the Italian Stallion was a real porn movie. Arnie was just in something that looked suspiciously gay. But it was Hercules? like... Hercules? 
No, yeah, well, yes. <laughs> Any of his properties. <laughs> would it be better about being uh, uh, Mr. Universe? So? <laughs> oh, he, it would have been amazing if he fucked any division twins. <laughs> Man, you're fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they only played the brothers, so whatever. But, uh, wait, but, it was but wait, but wait, wait, yeah. wait, wait. Actually, that would be They're a good... They're only half-brothers, right? Because of the genetic thing? No, Junior. Junior. Oh yeah. Daddy oh. DeVita fucked Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yeah, it wasn't that, a science experiment yeah, at all. Yeah, <laughs> that was actually like, yeah, that was it's, Dennis DeVito's it's baby. It's Trent Arnold, Tranold, Tranialt, What was the name of that? Uh, uh, how do how am I supposed to say it? like the guy who turned into a woman? Ah, uh, Bruce Jenner, the guy, yes. the Bruce Jenner. So like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Uh, like becomes uh, a what wait why the fuck are we talking about Arnold Schwarzenegger <laughs> uh, in the Julia, first place like, <laughs> and again that would have been my second pick would have been Red Heat instead of this movie yes right yeah. okay okay yeah yeah, yeah. okay <laughs> but enemy of the gates okay let's yes, let's get back let's, on the let's get into the let's let's open up the gates to the enemies and let's storm in I don't know I, because, I see only one enemy the, in the room because now. The <laughs> and that's capitalism <laughs> Man, no, it, so it was it was a book for of uh, of our founder Karl it, Marx. So yes, it, 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 not capital, capital. Yes, capital. Das Kapital. Da, well, no. Das, das Kapital. Kapital. <laughs> yeah, it's neutral. You know, it doesn't know its gender. Capital. Yeah, it doesn't. Yeah, it does, doesn't. Insecure capital. That's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> You're talking about Russian economy right now. <laughs> I, I mean, nowadays I, I'm, I could be talking about anybody's economy. Hey, oh, the end of the world. Except for Cuba. Oh, wait, too soon. Yeah. Okay. Anyhow, enemy at the gates. Yes. Boom. Um, we start off with a very nice hunting scene. Oh, yeah, beautifully that, shot. That, that was actually faked us out because the, yeah. we assume that he just shot the, the wolf. Yeah, there was a twist. He never yeah. shot the wolf when he was nine or, yeah. or whatever. Again, spoilers for this movie that's I think nobody cares at this old. point. Yeah, they were like, yeah. they've probably they zoned out watched, by almost for yeah. They're like, what the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> Dude, he played Edward the Gates. You know, now, like now, a, now a, I can't even cut it out because we reference it. And <laughs> the, no, actually, the Arnold Schwarzenegger. No, imagine, imagine Arnold Schwarzenegger would play in this movie like uh, Daniel Craig and Tom Hardy <laughs> played in Star Wars, you the, know, the, like the remake, and Stormtroopers. <laughs> dude, dude they, they should remake Enemy at the Gates. <laughs> Just with, instead of Ron Perlman, you have Arnold Schwarzenegger. And the main villain is because Idris Elba. this movie doesn't give a fuck of who plays a Russian. They they cast yeah. apparently 0% yeah. Russian for this movie. I, it's I, amazing. I don't know. The extras looked great. They looked some of very, the, very some of Slavic. The Nazis, some of the Nazi extras were also cast by Russians. <laughs> Yeah. They're like, why am I wearing this cloth? We're on the cover. Dude, so yes, we have to cut the budget. <laughs> like, <Yeah. laughs> Just put potato head into him, now he's kraut. <laughs> Something like that. But what yeah. I really respect about the movie is that they never tried to do the Russian accent. Yes. Which is like, uh, good. I thought that would Very be good. a total like, uh, how, how can you call it, like klukva, like uh, the, the, the cranberry, like. Soviet cranberry, like, oh, yes. my name is Vasily Zaitsev. I'm the best sharpshooter in the world. Like, yes. I'm going to kill more Nazis. But no, they didn't do it, which is which is great. Yeah, and Jude Law really pulls the role of being the main character. You really, you see that he he pulled out all his acting acting stops for this yeah. movie because yeah. he really sells this sells the role and so does most of the cast like ed harris as the evil oh. evil counter sniper yeah but why why did they why did they add a backstory to his character I mean, oh, he was fuck already that. No, that, that, he was already I mean, a great villain i, I mean, mean like, oh his son died in the first attack on stalingrad actually, i oh, think why? that's in the book and they're like and it's way bigger in the book, and yeah. they had to cut it down. Yeah, but, and the then book, the but the book was really altered for, for the movie. Yeah, of course it was, because it's, you know, nobody gives a fuck. Like, Jude Law's character, he doesn't read or write, but in reality, the guy, the Vasily Zaisov yeah. uh, sharpshooter, he was actually, like, he took courses in, in accounting yeah. and uh, <laughs> construction. That's, like, how, so. that's how he kept... But it. no, he couldn't read. He couldn't he, read. No, he was, the accounting <laughs> stuff really paid off. He was off, a telepath. Really paid off yeah. during, during his, his sniper days, because... 
he's like one plus one plus like one. how much do i get for these guys yeah, like yeah, yeah exactly <laughs> like he's doing like really uh advanced arithmetic oh there's the out. captain hmm, 100 bucks boom yeah exactly <laughs> He just does, does all the mouth. Private, and like, pr- pr- yeah. So he's a very ta- private. No, I'm not gonna kill a private. But it's, they they just they just put, portray him as this magic uh, sharpshooter that just has this natural ability of killing Nazis. <laughs> and they they introduce him by 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 wasting Captain five Soviet Union. Like his gun ha- holds five bullets, and he wastes five guys in a row. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that was. Like, uh, like two high-ranking Nazi commanders and three randos, like in the first first fifteen minutes of this movie, and yeah, it, that but, was quite hilarious. But, but I mean, the whole scene, the important German officer, an important German officer, comes out to take a shower. <laughs> yes, takes a shower yes. like in the middle of the fucking city, which is being attacked. It's it's, it's he, he's it's, like he's it's like he's doing like a, a, a what's his name. Stupid. Um, the 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 uh fuck uh colonel no uh commander now colonel colonel woods colonel kurtz kurtz, kurtz? from from um apocalypse now oh shit yeah <laughs> colonel kurtz or something <laughs> like like something something yeah. like he would do like yeah. We're horror like, yeah horror voice voice terror <laughs> or something you know voice terror yeah <laughs> <laughs> but and, I mean that the guy was as bloated as 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 But the as thing, is, but the thing is, I don't know if you watched it, but like we had uh, the Stalingrad movie, Russian a movie named Stalingrad, yeah. uh, which came out uh, I think 2013, 2014 or something. So, quite recent yeah quite recent and the problem is like in in russia yeah everyone's used to criticize hollywood movies for their stupidity yes. however like okay big budget russian movie about war stalingrad wow big epic yeah same fucking mistakes like same fucking <laughs> stupid shit like a german officer who commands the whole army which uh, holds stalingrad yeah like he walks out with a cigarette in the middle of a street like just oh yeah oh, yeah i'm know. taking a smoke yeah right yeah, now. yeah look at me i'm not and then no it's guards like, or anybody. Yeah, no guards, no one. Like, what yeah. the fuck? Yeah. I mean, come on. Breaching all the security But protocol. Hollywood is bad. Hollywood is bad, definitely. Hollywood is bad. I mean, man. I mean, it is directed by a French guy <laughs> and he you definitely see that he that there's a a, a non Hollywood influence in this movie. Because yes. it does it does some things <laughs> very differently. You know than, when, where when I noticed that? Yeah. When the Russian was right. <laughs> <laughs> when they made it like right in this movie i was yeah. like super pleased oh, all because the it, writings on the wall on the wall especially yeah. i was like uh maybe they just uh, wrote some random or uh, russian words on the wall no yeah no, there were actually phrases and that is 2001 which, before google translate so like people had yeah, to actually yeah, yeah, pick yeah, up yeah, a yeah. book or something yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. To do some to real, learn it. Yes. real research really? <laughs> Just didn't write Suka all uh, over or, or and over how again. In, uh, what's what was it? Born's uh, born. Uh, Which one? Born born, the first one, like when identity, he, when yeah. He, yeah, born's identity when he had the uh, the Not Russian born's passport. Born's identity. It's just the born identity. Born identity. <laughs> no, yeah, the born, born identity. identity. Yeah, yeah the born identity. I was in this. Mo- <laughs> I, w- I was. I would have been cast instead of Matt Damon, but 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 they but didn't. They, ca- they, they wanted didn't to cast ca- Ben Affleck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> More like Ben Arschflecken. Arsch means ass. We're back after this quick break. Yeah, there was a there was a very interesting break. Yeah, <laughs> you go. <laughs> Dennis is gone full 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 character actor now. Yeah, um, I do. I'm a master actor. I well, learned from Daniel Day Lewis and Day. Johnny Depp. <laughs> <laughs> and um, where were we? Oh, yes. Uh, the French, the French, the, the French influence. Still, yes. still, yeah. yeah, the French influence. You see that with with the way he, he tells the story and everything. It's uh, they 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 don't spoon feed you information most of the time, like an American movie would do. Like there are zero fucking flashbacks, except for the m- most important, the one thing that's important, the the hunt for it for for the wolf at the beginning that's the only kind of flashback and that's only to reveal the real story behind it and otherwise they 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 refrain from flashbacks like completely except for the the end of the movie where they did an in memoriam section basically which looked the 
weird as fuck where the the titles uh the 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 end credits rolled and they had like the the faces of the people like yeah, and yeah, and yeah, here's yeah, bob yeah, hoskins yeah. and he also died it was, but he it didn't was, like it, it looked, it bob like, hoskins it just like disappeared Oscars from this memory. movie yeah, yeah. it's all it, the, the whole movie feels like oh there are some actors we have like two mi two weeks of shooting time with and let's have them on the set for like 15 minutes in total in the movie But let's space it out so that everybody gets by the way, screen time. By the way, by the way, yes. I'm looking. I'm, I'm I'm looking at my notes and I realize that they're that fucking useless. That you don't you don't have any notes. <laughs> no, they're fucking useless. I mean, like <laughs> I took the notes and yes. uh, there's like uh, uh, the the biggest, like the largest writing there is said, like yes. Ron Perlman steals every scene. Yeah, and he's in, yeah because he's well, he only for he's in only for ten scenes. minutes. Yeah, ten <laughs> minutes. But he steals uh, this uh, every scene he's in. Oh, his character is so amazing. I mean, and uh, like oh the steel I really, teeth, amazing. the steel te the Look. story behind it. I mean, if you ever, for yeah. example, like if you ever. Uh, I don't know, like if you if you're into the movies and you know that Ron Perlman in the late '80s uh, played uh, the Beast in the video yes. of the Beast, yes, yeah, and now you see him like actually, I mean, Ron Perlman for me uh, as a Russian, he's the guy who always plays. He played in the Police Academy Seven when they went to Russia. You know, he played the main villain, uh, and uh, uh, what else? A Hellboy and yes. the guy, the guy uh, and of course, the guy from the Blade Two. Yeah, that awesome guy from Blade Two. But when you see him delivers a proper like drama monologue, it, in, it's good and it's, it's really, really good. good. Yeah. Also, I remember he played in Drive, but I don't really remember the movie because I always fell asleep. Whatever. Yeah. No, no, no. Ron Perlman is in a yeah. shit ton of stuff, and he's always good. That's mm -hmm, that's mm -hmm. just the truth. And in this case, he has the metal teeth from the the guy, the biter from the the earlier James Jaws, Bond. Jaws, Jaws, Jaws. Yeah, his Jaws. name was Jaws. Oh, yeah. in in German, der Beißer, I think. Beißer, biter. Beißer, yeah, the biter. Just. <laughs> oh, Beißer, like kiss. Yeah. Kiss Bezos. Bezos. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Bezos. Yeah, in Espanol. In Espanol. Espanol. Yeah, we're multicultural. Just like this movie. Again, they cast like a shit ton the of. The casting is amazing in yeah. this movie. I mean, for Bob real. Bob Hoskins as, as a Khrushchev. I mean, Khrushchev. Sorry, Khrushchev, not Khrushchev. Khrushchev. For fuck's sake. <laughs> that sounds so American. Khrushchev, Yopta. Yeah, Khrushchev. Come on. Yes. Sorry. But he, he I mean, and. Actually, well, I mean, I don't, I don't care, but you, you can I don't barely see the, but you can barely see the Super Mario in him anymore <laughs> with this role. Like he, he, had, really he, had, he had himself. better, he had better stuff to do. I'm not gonna <laughs> framing Roger Rabbit. I mean, Bob Hoskins yeah, is yes. amazing, but that made me recall the history of fact that actually Rucho was uh, the head of the whole Stalingrad uh, battle. Yeah, and actually, like that's how he got uh, really uh, high in in ranks in in the Soviet yeah, government. Yeah, well, if you turn around the the tide of war, yeah, yeah. that kind of makes you automatically. But, but that scene, yeah. but that scene in front of the officers. In, you mean like, you mean the, 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 the you mean the very nice collection of potatoes? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, everyone's like so Russian potato like guys. In Except his, for in Ralph, the uh, Mr. Fans in the background who looks oh, yeah, yeah. fine as hell. Yeah. Exactly. Except for the for the uh, for the Jewish commissar in the glasses, yes. was a PR agent for uh, Soviet yeah, army. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Jude Law mm -hmm. gets a PR agent. But that scene reminded yeah. me so much of Full Metal Jacket <laughs> introduction to yes. like the, the first scene. Like, yeah, it's you are camp. nothing. Yeah, you're, you're maggots. just maggots. Yeah, <laughs> he's like Khrushchev going going to them, and I and literally it it literally it's followed. basically the same scene. Yeah, yeah, it just literally with, followed. Like, with the Jewish guy was like. Is it you, John Wayne? Yeah. Is it me? He's like, who the fuck said that? Yeah. No, I'm, I'm sorry. Who the fuck said that? <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck? Are you a private joker? Come on. Yes. Oh, sorry. Commissar joker. Commissar, <laughs> Commissar joker. joker. Yeah. Please, come on. You, you have to defend Motherland. However, this uh, kind of like approach to the character as this uh, Soviet hero who, tr uh, who tries to win the war. Yeah. I... I kind of liked it. Uh, it it's, it's it's a it's a more refined propaganda piece in that in that case. Uh, I well, okay. If if you're a Russian listening to this shit, you know history more than me. Okay, fucking correct me. Yeah. However, it was a common thing uh, in 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 the war in all the wars that, uh, that about, about the propaganda. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we needed to promote our heroes to inspire the rest yeah, of the yeah, of the, the army. Yeah, 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 no, no, that that 
that definitely pos I mean th that's the whole reason why there were mm. were aces like flying aces like yeah, the yeah, yeah. the baron baron from uh, the red baron for example in the first world war oh yeah oh, yeah that, this that, guy yeah, 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 yeah. like the, oh, all Jesus, all yeah guy. the same thing happened in the second world war as well like you had a lot the, of a lot of aces yeah, yeah. yeah. That's why you give medals to to mass murderers, basically, mm -hmm. is to inspire other mass murderers. That's what war is. Like here, Actual you killed more people than the other. You got the high score this round, so you get a medal. And I hope this will inspire all the other guys to be jealous as fuck and also <laughs> murder more people. You know, that's basically what it is. It's like a very competitive round of Counter Strike. <laughs> But actually, actually, like. Like, uh, I think uh, I think that uh, people in Hollywood right now thinking about another movie like Enemy of the Gates because it's a great sniper movie, but it's about a man. However, yes. in the World War II, we had a, uh, not one, but like uh, we had several, but one of them, uh, female snipers, sharpshooters. Mm -hmm. yes. She's really popular. She was a hero. I don't remember her name. Uh, I, I still want to see one about the white, the white death. Of The Finnish uh, uh, oh. sniper who killed like oh, yeah, 300 guy, Russians. This guy, yeah, yeah, this guy. Well, the Soviet army couldn't fucking fought the war back then during the f in in Finnish Finland. Soviet yeah, war. that was a stupid ass idea, and you overcommitted on troops, material, and everything, and you didn't move. You say fuck you, all. you say you as if I participated no, in that event. No, like you, like when somebody says you Austrians, when you, you know. I don't say that. No, yeah, you're you're more more woke than me. That's that's just the truth. You I'm, just racist. I'm, I'm very asleep. You that's hate you hate the fact that I'm that I'm Russian. You're asleep. Oh for fuck's sake! Oh, there was a scene where the, where the Jude, when yes, Jude Law exactly. fell asleep. Yes, I'm that like, was there so was a bombardment. There was a bombardment, and Jude Law was like, "Okay, I'm just gonna take a nap for 12 hours." Like, and everybody assumed he was dead. Yeah, and he just said, "I fell asleep." No, you were unconscious. That's the proper this, term. That's the proper term. It, the, the movie really, really lost focus in the last half hour. Mm. Like it, it was on point with with the Ron Perlman stuff, and mm. it was on point mm. with the even the love story was, even though it was super cheesy and the most predictable shit ever. However, was was however. still fan was however. still fan, and Rachel Weisz was. A fucking brilliant choice because she's a dramatic actress that looks I'm still, at least as stunning as Jude Law. I'm still that, I'm still not on the board with the whole like ponytail thing because uh, oh yeah that's yeah, stupid she, ass she, yeah, yeah I mean I I mean come on everybody like she and plus the kid she and, and the, the kid, nails she nails and the kid done. she and the kid really? were clean all the yeah, fucking time oh, and and the kid I mean. The guy, the guy who played him, uh, he was. I the mean, kid actor, yeah. The kid, he, he was. Good. He was good. He was good. Uh, unfortunately, the guy like had only like six, uh, t uh, six movies in one TV show, which ran from 2001 to 2011. Dude, that's still so much. I mean, you still. I mean, you still, have enough money to become a real estate agent. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, <laughs> he still gets the enemy at the gates money. You know. <laughs> Every time mm. they show that the TV, yeah, but that, TV, that kid was like, it's, it's very probably. unfortunate that he stopped like acting because yeah. I think he would have made some some movies we, we, which featured kids much more better. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, he he could have been like uh, <clears throat> his generation's Macaulay Culkin, but he chose to be not that guy, I guess. <laughs> Yeah. Because he saw actual real world Macaulay Culkin, and he's like, "Nah, I'm not gonna be that guy." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was so, just gonna di disappear in a hole for ten years. I'm just, I'm just looking at my, uh, at my notes, and which I, are uh, not your notes anymore, or I don't know. I mean, yeah, okay. Yeah. Anyhow, yeah. Uh, I'm looking at my notes, and I see, for example, like, uh, oh, okay. Uh, yeah, red shirts. Like we have a lot of every, basically the uh, the tag uh, tagline of the movie. Everybody dies. Oh yeah, a lot so of red many, shirts. So many people. A lot of red shirts. Yes, and I, I mean, mean the they're act, all red. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Because if, red army. Yes. Yeah, we get the joke. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I have I, a sophisticated I, I, I audience. I thought I should have had explained. Yeah, you know? no, you should explain if if should necessary. Have had should yeah. have had explained. Yeah, should you have had explained. Yeah, it's it's. It's past imperfect perfect. <laughs> It's always perfect. Always, 
because Mother Russia only knows perfect. Yeah. <laughs> and we got rid of all other tenses. It's only perfect now. Always perfect. Yeah. Yes, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, the, so so it's basically the, the the main conceit of the movie is we we get to know this snipe, this normal Russian dude who gets to be a sniper yeah. and he gets better and better and the the Germans get nervous so they airlift in a really good counter sniper yes, and they have yes. basically a battle of wits and i and think that is the best part of the movie the game yes the hunt oh yes that's that's definitely the main driving force in this at movie harris, at harris plays uh and access it as the german sniper yes amazing yes both of them really re and you you definitely get that both of them are playing basically for their lives and you you see uh, the toll that it takes, especially of course on on our good character, but also on our bad character, who's who's also bribing the kid to give him more information. Yeah, that was a twist I never saw when I was a kid. With meat, like, what? more meat and chocolate. <laughs> I, because like my my parents switched off at the moment when the kid appeared and yeah. felt like oh it's a bullshit Hollywood movie. But it appeared that the there was a twist with the kid that yeah. he works for both sides. Yeah. Well, actually for the Soviet side, but uh, at German, the end. Germany thinks that he's uh, it, he got hanged. Yeah. Yeah. There's, that there's, is there's, like there's, yeah. That's that's where you see also the da -da 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 -da. French influence. Yeah. Where they're like oh. Kids, da -da 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 -da. Are, kids are also just humans. Let's just kill them. And it works really well at the end of the movie. Even though then the, the final sniper battle is actually not the best one. Because mm. the best one for me was in the factory. Where the, the friend of him got shot and they had to... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Had yeah, to, yeah, yeah. Ha he had to crawl back, basically. Yes, and yes, try yes. to get the gun back and everything. And why, that wait, didn't work. Wait, at this point, yeah. why the fuck did Rachel Weisz appear? Oh, because the, the, the shot guy ran back and told her? Yeah, but... And she was like, why, why? I'm going to help him now. I think... Because I'm in love with him, because he banged me that one yeah, time but, really but that well. that was one of the bullshit like, uh, moments. Next, like, ne next to the sleepy guy. Was she guy. a sniper, though? Was she a sharp No, shooter? she was just a normal foot soldier, basically. Then why the fuck did she... I mean, I, I, th this is like a very bullshit no, that's, moment, that's, I think. Yeah, oh, oh, no, that's, that's definitely to, the, to further the plot and also be like, oh, let's get Jude out of here. Plus the reflections in the glass. Oh, that was hilarious, yeah. I mean, like... Yeah, no, no. Shot in the pavilion, it's... <sighs> Again, I think that they, they shot it in real life and they're like, ah, oh, fuck, this doesn't work. Let's just tape it over with green stuff so we can impost, just can add some 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 real nice reflections of Truth Law's face from fi five different shots of glass that yeah. all magically <laughs> point into his direction. Yeah, I mean, it was, it was like coincidence, like... <laughs> Uh, but however the, yeah. how it was shot it's beautiful the cinematography in this movie yes. is amazing well how, very well I mean, done yeah in the beginning when you like when you're uh, thrown into this meat grinder of uh, a russian forces trying yeah. to get back uh, back into stalingrad get get, 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 get take, take back the stalingrad uh, it's like saving private ryan all over but with the commissars shooting in the back yeah at the backs of of, of the foot soldiers yeah however after that the movie like just starts getting better and better i mean like oh yeah i mean yeah, yeah no no i thought that was just a stupid hollywood movie about soviet army however i mean as there a russian some, i kind of liked it yeah i mean really not that kind of even i liked it yeah it's it's not better movie i mean okay there are some like bullshit moments and i don't know about that like it has commissar commissar like uh having this very like manly friendly relationship with vasily zaitsev for yeah. some reason like oh let's hug let's like okay it, it felt <laughs> like it felt like really uh, just like really we are all just comrades under the sun serving one purpose you know yeah it felt I wouldn't say gay, but uh, oh, dude, they they were so gay for each other. It was amazing. It it was like, Ju mm. no, no, seriously, Jude Law had more 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 chemistry with with him than with Rachel Weisz's character. Yeah, yeah, that definitely. as well. That as well. Like, Especially because Rachel Weisz did the panic eyes the, the whole way through the sex ah, scene, ah. which looked like yeah, she was in distress. Yeah, had a sex scene with, a Ra with I Rachel mean, I mean, I, I get what she was going for, but it didn't work on camera. It always looked like she was like a, an, a fish on, a, a, on land, like... 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, what the it, fuck is happening? And the best thing was the guy in the background who's like to pretending to, and be, turning, asleep, yeah, to be asleep while wanking one off. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh yeah. And yeah. the other guy who was smoking. Yeah. Like no, they didn't notice to like two persons. Uh, having ah, come sex. on, come on, Hollywood. We know what's going on. Yeah. We do. You know. We do know. Yeah. Jude, do Jude, know. Jude's putting down some law. Yeah. Yeah. And the law is penis and vagina in this case. I actually want to compliment the sound of the movie. Actually. Oh like, yeah, you wanna you wanna move on and and close up the the plot. Oh, the plot. Oh, yeah. Okay. Because so, oh, surprise, surprise, he kills the, the 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 German sniper. Yeah, but only after like uh, the the German guy kills the Jewish commissar. And, yes. Uh, and yes. Like uh, he, he, they they have a standoff on the railway station. And Rachel station. Weisz's character gets random shrapnel into her body, so she can't be in the last yeah, last she part of the movie. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> yeah, I guess they kill off every everybody except him and her. Which and is okay for my race. We regenerate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you just throw bo- uh, ah. That's why you just throw a bottle of vodka on the floor. It just grows up into a a, a full gra- full grown uh, Russian, Russian again. Yeah, yeah. Well, Russians are like that. <laughs> yeah, just 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 out here doing God's work uh, on my Russian vodka farm. Vodka cloning farm. Yeah, <laughs> they are not real. Cloning centers are real. I don't. I don't even know if the uh, the the Mac picked that up. But whatever. Um, <laughs> cloning centers are real. Let's move Anyhow, on. To, yeah, moving let's, on. Let's move on to cinematography. Wait, first, already. Okay, cinematography. Yeah, yeah, sure. The first thing that. Got catched our eye was the excessive use of uh, Russian letters. Oh, Russian letters! Like they used oh. those fake Russian letters for for everything in 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 the in the in the in the beginning and at the end of the uh, credits. They, yeah. they just used those fake Russian letters. Yeah, I mean that was. It's like it looked like a typeface. That, that was a fake introduction. Word. That was a fake introduction. Like that yeah. was leading us into something like, oh, like Russian army yeah. is gonna win. Why, why, yeah, it, uh, which, turns out, which turned out to be a really depressive the, movie. The, the score didn't use anything from the from da, the, da, 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 da. from the red army choir which is amazing mm. because every fucking hollywood movie does that for a russian movie they always use that those fucking guys and this movie didn't which is you know props to them but that's not cinematography what is cinema photography is a few very very nice swivel shots they had some amazing swivel shots where they where they just went around the subject while they were yeah. talking and, yeah, 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 yeah. and tried to uh, uh, get somebody else into the focus and that worked really well. What also did well what what worked well back in two thousand one but doesn't anymore is the CGI. Like some of the CGI for two thousand one, very decent, yeah. too good, yeah. And nowadays it lo- all looks like cheap computer game graphics like from five years ago uh, yeah but no but that's that, just technology you know they, they didn't, they didn't especially have, the, the they didn't have scene. that they didn't have that much of the cgi yeah they, i love the, the the fake airplanes they used mm. for the bombing raids and the the the, 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 the instead of uh the the bombs the, falling out like you know at a proper pace they just tumble out because the game model, uh, the, the 3D model apparently rendered it that way or something. It looks hilarious nowadays. It's quite funny to, to see that. Like, However. Like the, the CGI r- department really bombed at, at putting those models together. He doesn't let me speak. Sorry. It's, 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 that was my fine. quick rant. No, no, no. No, you're completely right. However, I would like to acknowledge the fact yeah. that they used really good props in this movie. I don't know. Yes. I don't know exactly how historically accurate they Some, were, but the, the, the fact that they took the fountain from the uh, central Stalingrad. Yeah. That was really cool. I mean, I don't know the uh, the topography of the of the city yeah. like, but however, it was really nice and the costumes, everyone looked great, especially the actors, the actors man. Fuck. Yeah. They really that's the French influence. Of the cinematography, so, like he attention really, to detail. Yeah, the detail and and the extras, like he like every extra, 
acted in that movie like mm. for real yeah they had expression on their faces they were like we are involved in this this is happening to us right now yeah we are in actually in a war yeah and it it it, it, it also paid off yeah you said the props like like the tanks mm -hmm. really well done mm -hmm. the 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 the, the, uh, boats. the costumes yeah the costumes the I costumes don't know. were on point no for, for the most part were really on point you see it especially like especially with ed harris character like the the use of the different kind of crosses that yes, you got awarded yes. and all that stuff and they like put emphasis on that in the movie like that that shows a level of of of, of detail that a normal Hollywood movie might have just glazed over. With. I actually think that Tarantino referred to that uh, scene actually, with an the American, cross in, an American in, 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 in Glorious Bastards. Yeah, an, an American movie would have just introduced one American that was in Stalingrad on vacation or something. Like in a Godzilla movie, observing. Yeah, you know, exactly. Like, yeah, and his, German and, forces. And are approaching because, because if it there's is a terrible. hero he has to be american you know like they force it into so many things that would have been hilarious if jude lost character my name is uh my name is frank douglas or something you know or no it, more of a sniper pun probably my name is scoopy scoopy scope or something uh, <laughs> that was a bad all one. right maybe if Jude Law's character was named something like uh, hello, hello, my name is Mike Smith, I'm just, I'm just here to, to, to kill some Nazis, you know, I like, yeah. I like killing some Nazis, uh, that's my <laughs> fucking job, I, I'm, I would love to kill some more Nazis, but it's uh, 2018, I gotta kill Nazis, yes. although I can go to this, uh, what's the name of the city, when they had like uh, Nazi marching across, something Which? will, like it, was, it happened last year, okay, like not Nashville, but uh, oh yeah, 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 uh, Charlestown. Uh, uh, Charlestown or Aurora? No, Charlestown. Okay, Aurora was, Charleston. was another shooting, I think. Whatever. No, 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 I don't know. The, 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 the march of Nazis, like yeah. Amer America. America, America. By the way, Alan Henderson, Alan Henderson, huh? Alan Henderson was supposed to be on this podcast. This American guy, oh, yeah, you know, like fuck these, Alan. yeah, fuck Alan, yeah, fuck, fuck, you, fuck you for having responsibilities and a kid and a family and a lovely wife and you know. Uh, uh, Did you uh, know that he in actually general, visited Russia? Right, nice personality, huh? What he visited Russia, he performed with us oh, in Russia, yes, yeah, nice. in Moscow. And did he bomb or not? No, he didn't. Oh, an American that doesn't bomb in Russia, weird. Never happened. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Russia still doesn't have its own 9/11. It's very interesting. Like even the, the uh, Moscow, even the Moscow uh, opera thing wasn't like really your 9/11. Like how many people died there? 136, something like that. Really should do really should touch this topic. I mean, we had s like I don't know more than 10 terroristic attacks. Yeah, but they're all tiny attacks. They're like you know, make it your home office kind of. Uh, back in the home office kind of uh, attack not not 3,000 people at once that's all I'm saying it's 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 Russia didn't have like I mean I guess if you if you believe the conspiracy theories and uh, um, yes continue <laughs> please yes of course I would love I would love to, I mean, to I mean, hear the rest of what you're if saying you, if you if, Her, you, Her Norman. if you if your government has already the the shape and form of a terrorist organization and it terrorizes terrorizes your people i guess you have a 9 11 every day i have no legal jurisdiction uh, yeah you you want to go back into your in, own country in, in commenting on that <laughs> i can't i, I i'm I pleading have. the fifth amendment which doesn't exist in russia because <laughs> <laughs> you have to always incriminate, uh, incriminate yourself in Russia to, to be... Uh, uh... Просто для справки, если кто слушает это из России, на минуточку, uh, Пол, он типа австрийцы, он не совсем понимает, что происходит в России, поэтому... Uh... I'm right now, probably. В общем, слушайте, это все он, это все он, это все, это все Пол. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Yeah? Anyhow, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That was a little intermission for Russian audience. Oh, sweet! Yeah, my five people out of Russia. Can you can you speak any Hindi? Oh, duck, duck, duck. <laughs> <laughs> Please return. 
I love the I love the Bombay Shuffle. It is a, one of my favorite dances. Please come again. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. No. That that's that's the maximum your, amount of 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 Hindi we your, can your, master. Your 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 Adobe product doesn't work properly. I'm gonna help you fix it. <laughs> just just buy a new license and a new computer and throw the rest in the trash again because that's how we roll here at, at uh, Indian uh, customer service. That was just an ad for an Indian commercial for Indian Indian English service, which helps you to sell stuff. <laughs> da, 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 da. I'm cutting this out. <laughs> I'm going to cut this out. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah. Sounds. Yeah, sound design was amazing in this movie. For real, like that yeah, scene. Yeah, the, the, like the, the bullhorn that goes or he moves yeah. around the screen. Yes, and it, and yes, it, yeah, yeah. And the sound changes like three times. Yeah, like when it has he turns. a real Doppler effect, basically. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, really well done. Then the, the explosions are on point. The alcohol that Dennis is pouring coming. himself is, is on point. And, and, on point. and again, it shows that level of detail. Thanks. For, Jesus Christ. Dude, don't be a pussy. <laughs> I'm, I'm finishing bottle right now. <laughs> what? Are you jealous or something? Like, come Je on. jealous of bottle? No, I'm not jealous of bottle. I'm jealous of movie which we already oh, finished. Well, we finished the movie which name is Oh, uh, Enemy of the Gate. We, right. We, we have Balalaika music. Oh yeah, we have. Well, no, we modern have modern ones. Modern ones. We we got some sweet ass Balalaika music. No, but for real, like the att attention to the details is is really good. I mean, I cannot, as I said before, I'm not uh, like a historian, so I cannot say if everything was accurate, but uh, pretty much, pretty much accurate. Yeah. Like everything in sound, in uh, in the, in the props, everything. Yeah. Yeah. The, we had some Russian speech there as well, which is like was yeah, random, in the random. Yeah, in the background, random yeah. Russian speech. Yeah. Or, or the, the 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 one Russian who fathered out three candles, <laughs> and that's not even fake. That actually happens in the movie. In the mm -hmm. background, you just have a guy farting out three candles, yeah. Yeah. which is. I think just you know one of the extras was like walked up to the the, the, the walked up to the uh, uh, director and was like, "Hey, I was I have special skill," <laughs> and he's like, "What man?" And he's, I can fart out three candles at once. You are promoted immediately. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you. G I want extra role where I fart out candles, and he's like, "I guess so." Why Why do I have to hire him? And then he's like, oh, he's like Putin's son. Oh, wait, in 2001, I guess he's... Who's? Sorry, what? Boris Yeltsin's son. Boris Yeltsin's son. <laughs> oh, man. 2001? Yeah. That would... Uh, that would inauguration of uh, Vladimir Putin was... No, it was in 2000, I think. Uh, it's been that long already? Yeah. Yeah, man. I think, I think Russian years feel long. <laughs> Russian elected officials feel longer than they actually yeah, are. Yeah, I'm 28, but and I remember all the three of Russian presidents. Can you imagine that? Like when you ask, like in American school, yeah. how many presidents did you have? And like and name them and uh, what they achieved. It's like what 64 or what? Like it's how a, many? it's a it's a number. It's, yeah, in it's, Russian Federation, yeah. we had three. I yeah. mean, of course, we had USSR. Which is like a yeah, Lenin, but those Stalin, are those, yeah, but Khrushchev, those were general secretaries, Brezhnev, basically. Andropov, Chernenko, yeah. plus a few other old guys who died like immediately, and then Gorbachev, and then Boris. Yel oh wait, emergency committee, and then Boris Yeltsin, Yeltsin, yes, Putin, Medvedev, Putin, yeah, and Putin again. Come on, Med Medvedev, just so he can cover his ass in the meantime. He didn't even like really. Yes, please speak more. <laughs> By the way, I have a gun in my hand. Yes, yeah, yeah. Going back to the movie. Going Enemy back the to the case. movie. Enemy the yeah. Case. Um. Any anything else you have to add to the sound? And anything else? Mm -hmm. No, really. No. The, the the sound is amazing. Everything. The, the, it's, it's so you well, actually it's really good noticed that the the soundtrack. The, like because he used like four Shit, notes yes, or five yeah. notes. James the, the, Horner is the composer. Yeah, yeah, and he used the same thing in Avatar apparently. Yes, I I was like <laughs> like seven years later. It, where the fuck did I hear that? Where the fuck did I hear that? Ta -na 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 -na. 
And I'm yeah. like, I've been, I've been, I've been like asking myself for uh, 90 minutes, like, where the fuck did I? And I googled the composer James Horner and his movies, and boom, Avatar. Yes, that's Avatar music. Dun, 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 dun. Like he just reused his his uh, yeah his his signature tune basically. That's all he did basically here. No, but we didn't hear that in uh, Amazing Spider-Man though. Yeah, that's true. I, I don't know. Maybe he hid it and somewhere. And not in the Toy in Story the, as well. James Horner. Yeah, the, again, maybe he hid it somewhere in the in the in the in the background. You know, w like Woody realizes that uh, the he's, spaceman he's, the spaceman is a new toy. Yeah, and he's like turning into the camera and like -na 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 -na. <laughs> <laughs> anyhow okay w w wrong promo oh that no. wrong promo yeah fucking wrong promo That's yeah he, 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 his his speech was pretty amazing he 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 talked about his teeth getting kicked out basically and he had uh, metal teeth he looked he looked amazing too like the from a visual standpoint he even smoked a cigar oh, for like yeah, two yeah. seconds i, I want to I, I, I want to thank the movie for uh, adapting accurate, the, accurate yeah, cigar, cigar, yeah, roll, rolling. rolling the cigarettes yeah uh, in uh, during the war from the newspapers uh, yeah And, and the one probably had the biggest one like that yeah was like, like it looked <laughs> like crazy. hellboy also also only for like Two hot seconds. Yeah, that in and the next, then in, in the next, next scene, shot, it's a normal next, sized yeah, one. Yeah, it's yeah. hilarious. Like, like they're okay, like, we, wrong, up. we can't let you we'll have leave that. It. We will leave it. Yeah, and the CGI wasn't good enough back then to reduce the size of the sure. that or increase the size, so that they had to stick with it. It looked, it looked, it looked magnificent. I must say, I yes. must say that this movie for me yeah. is way better than Pearl Harbor. Oh. Pearl Harbor is a hot piece of garbage of a movie. It has some sweet ass special effects, but the rest The Barbama scene was so really good, bad. but everything else. Yeah. Yeah, it's so bad. Actually, guys, check out the version where it synced to the uh Baloo uh, um um tailspin. The, uh, yeah. Oh yeah. And then the Oh yeah, Chudisa. Oh yeah, Chudisa. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Oh, hey, oh, Balu, oh, hey, oh, Balu. But he's not Balu. He's a different fucking character. Fine, they just fine, reused. Fine, they just reused fine, the same fucking animation. Yeah, well, they 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 just fucking reused uh, Shir Khan. No, Khan yes, too. Yes, they did. So they, did. they always did. Yeah, the, the monkey is too. That he has the bar. You know. Yeah. So, yeah. so oh, hey, oh, 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 Freunde sind durch dick und dünn. Ballo und seine Kurse. Then some freestyle rapping in German. Dum 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 dum. Dum 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 dum. Yeah. So after this quite quick. Yeah, you see, we connected. Like Austrians and Russians watched the same fucking Disney cartoons when they were kids. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, yes. Yes. Um, all right. Let's move on to best moment. Oh, man. Uh, I think like the moment when uh which i remember the, the like the, the the latter um the moment when the uh, jewish commissar got shot that was a really good delivery and uh yeah that was that was pretty pretty well done when yes. ron, ron perlman got shot i mean everyone got the shot in the movie but like when <laughs> ron perlman got shot as well like it was like because they they like ron perlman was rolling the uh, the string with the uh, with the metal cap you know to um, And take they take the German sniper out. Oh yeah, yeah. You know, and they're like, but the German sniper isn't there. And then they decide to jump over the uh, the gap. Yes. In the building. Uh huh. And the Ron Perlman got shot in the in the mid air. Yeah, and gone. Yeah. yeah. The character it was like, gone. Yeah. Fuck. So me. well done. So yeah. Well done. Yeah. And the last standout standoff. Sorry, yeah. standoff. Fuck. That yeah. was really good. Yeah. Uh, no words. That, no words. I like that. I thought. I actually thought that a German sniper would give a speech. Yeah, yeah. Just, And he didn't. Yeah, no. Just, just got shot just, in the fucking eye. Yeah, because he fucking hanged the kid before that. Yeah, the, the hand kid. There was a really good moment. That, that Jude, was, Law, yeah. Jude Law and Rachel Weisz were kissing and whatnot. And then all of a sudden Rachel was like, what the fuck is that? She takes yeah. her binoculars yeah, and, and sees and the kid. sees the hanged kid. Yeah, which like two scenes ago, the German uh, officer was like, "Yeah, and yeah, she get loses more. her shit." Which you will, obviously, you, you would. You will get more uh, ger German yeah. chocolate. 
Yeah. Ja. <lacht> also, And he, hands he had an unlimited supply of, of chocolate. Like, that was also, was like... fucking jealous throughout the movie. Like, yeah, he had... Hey, kid. And, like, have more really, chocolate. And, like, really good chocolate. Also, yeah, do you and, like balloons? And, and it, do you like balloons, Georgie? My name is Sasha. Do you like balloons, Sasha? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Um... What, Kiss me, fat for, boy. For, for me, the the standout scene was definitely um, standoff. The, the 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 first real standoff in the in the modern in the, in the factory. Oh, okay, on okay. the factory floor. Oh yes, 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 yes. But also with the mannequins. Yes, with the mannequins. Oh shit! Yeah, that was really good. That was that was really good. And the one guy, uh, she, the Austrian character, freaking out because of the. The, uh, sorry, not no, the no, Austrian. No, no, he, he was a Soviet. Austrian, we the, thought he was. Yeah. Uh, he, we thought he was Played German, but actually, there was uh, there was a Soviet soldier. Yeah, he yeah. was freaking out like, "Holy shit, he fooled us!" Again, a lady played by an Austrian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. The Austrian actress. The Austrian actress. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and she gets she gets uh, like boned hard in that scene. <laughs> no, yeah. really, she gets she gets fucked. Uh, yeah, she Bob oh, Yeah, she she's dead. And you, that was like, I'm like, oh no, you, you wasted the one Austrian in like minute 20. What the fuck is happening? Oh yeah, and they wasted the, the oh yeah, okay. You still um, have Christoph Waltz though, so. Yeah, um, 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 I think we're done with best moment, we can go on to uh, secret I just want to say, yeah. I just want to say that this scene, uh, reminiscent of uh, Blade Runner scene in the end, where uh -huh. Harrison Ford chased uh, Rudy Howard's character because the whole house like kind of looked like, it. and I understand why Denis Villeneuve, what is his name, Denis, who directed the the last Blade uh, Runner, uh, yeah, Villeneuve, French, Villeneuve, French, Villeneuve, French, French, yeah. Press, yeah. yeah, yeah, I think because this is Frenchy so press. this is so European, this is so European, I mean, even in the uh really cause blade runner this is not like how you shoot a hollywood movie like the last mm. 20 minutes of the movie is just a harrison ford chasing yeah. uh, a naked dutch guy like across the building yeah but it's one of the best things ever it's so good yes yeah and the, the same thing applies here it's 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 all about the the, the those characters nothing about the the rest of the world it's just uh, about except them. for love yeah 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 we the, should mention i mean love. the power of bonus is always stronger You know, mm -hmm. yeah. No, uh, but um, 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 let's let's go on to mm, the mm, mm, yes. Mm. Sorry, one last thing about yes. love. One last thing about love. The fact that there was a love triangle between uh, the Jewish commissar Jude yeah. Law's character and Rachel Weisz yeah. character. I love the fact that like they showed him. Like, I mean, we thought he was a creep. But Fine's character, yeah. But he loved that woman, and he got yeah. shot. Like he, he told them she's not going back, even though she survived somehow. Yeah, whatever. Which man. would be better if she died? However, well, okay, fuck it. But then he's just like, I love this woman. She died. Boom, kills, like basically, yeah, commits suicide. But when he looks at her, and they show that he's like smelling, like he gets the scent of a woman. Mm -hmm. No, no, sorry. He has the scent of a woman. <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> Booyah. 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 Um, yeah. Say hello to my little friend. <laughs> okay. Um, was the worst Al impression ever. So, yeah, that was a pretty bad. Hoo-ha. 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 Say hello to my little friend. Say hello to my little friend. Uh That was that was more like Indian. <laughs> yeah, that was more like Indian, like Indian Alpacino. I long to my little friend. Indian Pal Indian Palacino, yeah. Palacino. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> Calcutta China. Calcutta China. <laughs> yes. Uh, say, say hello to, to my little friend. His name is Raji. His name is Raji. My little friend. Say yeah. hello to him. Yeah. Hello, yeah. hello, Raji. He's an hello. absurdly tiny Indian. <laughs> You can, can actually you, shove him up your ads. Can you believe that uh, one Indian soap opera got to the Russian main television? Nice. And it was like all the 354 episodes of that shit. <laughs> like for real. And my friend watched it all while being stoned. Uh. While being stoned. And he told me, dude, dude, this is an amazing shit. I was like, It's dude, like not. friends, but Indian. <laughs> no, it's more, it's like the, the lady, the lady. Yeah. She's in love with this 
Indian guy. Yes. You know, like Indian guy. He's the main hero. Super but dramatic. But they cannot guy. be together. For some fucking reason, even though there is not a legit logical reason why they cannot be together. And like every episode, they're like, oh. Drama. Mm, oh. And they have a goat in the family. Yes. A goat? Yeah, which is a part of family. I think that's, that's probably the connection to Russia. They're like, oh, they have goat too. We can relate. Yes. No, it was about the mother who was always uh, like against marriage somehow. Okay. Even though they, he was rich. Well, she got pumped very with, She got pumped with, with, with her, house, her, her first husband. I mean, literally, she, he, she, he put her on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Well, anyhow, back Which to the... Which does happen in India. Whatever. What's with the secret? I uh, mean, everything secret. happens if you have a billion people. If, uh, if you have a billion Austrians... At some point, some fucked up shit, really fucked up shit's gonna happen. So yeah, like Austria Hungary Empire. That's the that's the one benefit of having a small status with so many with so little people. The the, the cases of having a real nutcase. Paul, Paul. Is, can I ask you a question? Can, could, yes. I, could I ask you a question? If Austria annexes Budapest, yeah, no, would you be like? Fight back. Would you be like? Oh, I mean. What the fuck did you expect? <laughs> yeah, they are just happy that we're st- gonna start renovating everything. And like, shit, thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> thank you so much. We're so tired wait, of this Russian getting, investment. Wait, we're getting Austrian healthcare right now? Oh, yeah, we are totally in. Yeah, thank you, man. Yeah, what about the Austrian healthcare, by the way? It's, it's, it's all right. It's all right. You know, free dental, mm. free, free everything. Hi, Mecca. Hi. Drinking whiskey in the midnight. It's, oh it's like Obamacare Minute. on steroids, so... Here, Obama. Obama so, von Baraka. <laughs> oh, that's so stupid. <laughs> Welcome that sounds to like Russia. an Austri- uh, That sounds like a Paul pun. Welcome to the minute of Russian humor. Yeah, Baraka. So, uh, so sorry, secret? Obama. No, wait. Obama von Baraka. All right. Secret category. Mm-hmm. Now I have two Jeez. possible ones. And Being I think... Russia or this German Third Reich? What do we I think choose? I think uh, uh yeah let's let's do this yeah <laughs> Oh hi Mark Oh oh hi I Mark. did not I did not hear her I did not I did not hear her um, Oh hi Mark mm, mm, mm. Is this secret secret category yeah shoot me shoot me shoot me Is this a Call of Duty game Because Oh man Because some oh, of this man. stuff of 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 it really reminded me of the first Call of Duty game. Yeah, the, the, but the, Call of Duty. No, no, King, it was verbatim, released in two thousand three, two thousand four. Like the scene where they got the gun, the rifles, and the ammunitions at the beginning, and you either got bullets or a gun, was exactly the same at the beginning of the call, first Call of exactly. Duty game. Exactly. Exactly one by one the same thing, and then the 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 the, the fight in the in the russian train yard oh and the fucking the the the, the communications li- lines oh you that did, was the best scene you didn't oh, have no. to you didn't ah. have to you didn't have to snipe ah, the, ah. you didn't have to snipe them you had to patch them because you were in the call of duty game you had to patch them i think that was the second actually that was actually the second call of duty game if i never I remember played call correctly. of duty but they came out after Only this Modern movie Warfare. they came out after this movie so they definitely just were like watching enemy at the gates and they're like this looks like a cool level. Let's copy it with Batum. <laughs> like they just took the whole movie, like whole chunks of the movie and made a computer game level out of it. And they didn't get copyright strike. Like if I just take chunks of this movie and implement it in my movie, I get so... Ha- I get slammed so hard by by uh, uh, a cease and desist letter. I don't even know what it means anymore to move as a human being, because cease and desist. Whatever. Um. Yeah. What did you think? <laughs> what a story, Paul. <laughs> That's a great Tommy Wiseau. Way better than your Al pa- fa- f- f- fail Pacino. <laughs> you mean your fail Pacino? Fail Pacino. Yeah. <laughs> Anyhow, no, but you uh, you mentioned like a really good, <laughs> really good gag there, like when Jude Law 
gets the just the bullets for yes. the rifle he gets the rifle and I immediately recall the episode like the scene from uh hot shots Pardieu. yeah Pardieu. <laughs> when the, charlie sheen throws like uh, all the bullets, bullets, bullets at, at like 20 like the, enemies yeah, the, and the, the all Iraqi that. army is just yes. like ah like however i cannot see that it's not historically accurate because Probably we didn't have enough rifles, but I cannot say I cannot say that it's like 100% accurate. Maybe some people would who, who are listening to a podcast from Russia would be like, "No, we are rifles. We are." Yeah, there were. I, I mean, I, the whole thing was just to waste the resources uh, of the Germans. So giving them less rifles and less ammunition is totally fine because. It's mostly about the other guys. You know, the, the one scene with uh, from Futurama where it's like, we defeated the robot's army by just sending waves after waves of our own ma- people until their kill limit, yeah. until yeah, the yeah, robot's yeah. kill limit was reached and they shut themselves down. Yeah. Basically, the same strategy was the Russian strategy in St- Stalingrad. Uh. Just throw enough material against the enemy until he just gives but, up. But, 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 and our, it worked. But uh, please, dear audience, like if you're listening to this, correct, correct us if, uh, correct me if I'm yes, wrong. Yes, yes, in like the comments that, below. <laughs> in the comments below, that uh, the fact that the German army actually like um, fucked up is that like first reason that uh, first reason that uh, US, USA stopped funding Hitler because he ran out of money, and the second reason is that. Uh, I forgot the name. The German of uh, general who was um, the head of the African you mean, campaign. You mean the, the African campaign? Yeah, the Desert Fox. Yeah, yeah, Desert Fox. That shit. Mm. They demanded more ammunition and uh, yeah, because and it, vehicles. I mean, he was more successful with his campaign too. So not really. No, in in when By it comes to in when it comes to like direct wins in battles when it comes to tank to tank engagement mm. he won like most of the stuff i presume paul's playing uh tanks again. <laughs> a world of tanks world no, of tanks yeah no, world no, of tanks. no i say a world of thanks to that world of uh, thanks ah i see what yeah, you did there yeah. however no i'm but, just shooting straight up compliments towards my enemies <sighs> Uh, that's a game developed yeah. by Russians. They, by the way. they are shell shocked by the way I compliment their skills. He's a stalker, ain't he? <laughs> also, reference to a Russian game. Yes. But, uh, however, uh, I just recalled a really good movie with John Belushi. Uh, not John Belushi. <laughs> Fuck, I fucked it up. Jim Belushi. Yeah, the other, the baddest Belushi. The, the other Belushi. The other Belushi. Belushi. Yeah, yeah, everyone's calling it the other Belushi. No, Gene Belushi is also a great actor. Fuck off. I loved him. I knew him, I knew him first before I was yeah. introduced to John Belushi. Sahara. The movie has Sahara about okay. about uh, Americans trapped in uh, uh, on, in Sahara in an ancient fortress against German soldiers. It's a really great movie. It's like <laughs> 80s, late 80s, uh, early 90s uh, that Fury. Fun. That Fury. Fun. No, no, no. It was a really good movie. No, trust okay. me, dude. Trust me. Fuck yeah. off. Trust me. It's a really good movie. <laughs> it's right. a really good movie. It's like in the end, the Germans were like, "We surrender because we need to fucking drink. <laughs> we need, we need a, wa- thirst, we need water. We need water. Our thirst for water is only matched by our thirst for thirst for war. Yeah. The 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 Vasa. Their 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 war uh, water. We want what water? Why the fuck is he saying water? Even though he's Austrian. Water. Sorry. Österreich. Österreich. All right. Anyhow, secret uh, category, whatever. Yeah, is this a card game? Yes, it is. Mm-hmm. Short answer. This is definitely a Call of Duty game, mm-hmm. and Jude Law is the mm-hmm. is the. It's the one with the with the with the wall hack and all the cheat codes activated to snipe every character in this game. Never played, never played uh, first. But you two, know three. what wall hacks are. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I look in Russia. We had this amazing uh, computer game magazine called Igramania. <laughs> okay. Which igra in uh, in in Russian means game, and it was all about Ooh. computer games. And I was buying it since 1998. Mm. And like I didn't play those games, and like most of the games I read about in this in the journal, yeah. but like I read all about Call of Duty and all the other games, and I was so happy when in two thousand five I played Star Wars: The Old Republic. That's a good ass movie. Nice, sorry, nice, yeah, good, nice good of as, the Old good Republic. Good ass computer game. Yeah. yeah. 
The Old Republic and The Old Republic 2. Both, yes, both, actually. Both, both, repu- both Republics. Even though it was bugged good. as fuck, but yeah. yeah. All right. Final so, conclusion. Final conclusion. Final so, conclusion, would you recommend this audience? movie? Would you would you watch it again? What 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 what's um, your final verdict mm-hmm. of this movie? It's the Russian actually. I really found that movie not that bad. For yeah. real though. I mean, I, I thought it was worse. No, really. I mean, like it's not a bad of a movie. Yeah. Everyone's shitting on it, especially in Russia like Oh, like uh, he gives a potato to Jude Law, whatever. I actually <laughs> never found that scene in that movie, or maybe I'll just, just keep talking. It. I'm gonna go and be right back. Uh, yeah, Paul just uh, defected. <laughs> he is calling the police right now so they can take out the uh, Russian spy. Even though, yeah, Enemy at the Gates is a uh, good piece of cinematography. I mean, some stuff is stupid, like the uh, love uh, story. I mean, she got a shot in her stomach, and then yet she still survives. There was this scene in the end when she, he, uh, Jude Law's character, Vasily Zaitsev, he walks through the hospital to find her, and thought, this is a great moment to end this movie, because it was shot by a French director. Like, he just walks through the hospital to find her. Good. Is she, is she alive? Is she dead? We before the next scene we don't know that, but that in the next scene we see that she's fucking alive. But before that, we we saw that she has uh, closed eyes and stuff and uh, had closed eyes. But uh, yeah, it was it would be a great ending to that movie. However, no, they like they found each other, and yeah, okay. And then now we got the titles, the credits roll, and it's all that. Uh, Tokyo Instagram filter in memoriam like we have this gay scenes between the Jewish commissar and Vasily Zaitsev and Ron Perman like all this like hey look at these guys they were in this movie yay yeah which like the conclusion is a really fucking depressive <laughs> movie to be honest because everyone dies yeah Everyone but, fucking dies yeah. in a really horrible manner. I mean, I did not expect that the I mean, kid most, most that the kid was shot. hanged. Yeah. What the fuck? The kid didn't even get shot. They hanged the kid. Which they is, hanged the kid publicly. Know. Yeah, it it reminded me of of, 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 of uh, uh, Screamers, the movie with uh, Peter Weller. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, Philip wow, Dick uh, based Jesus based on Philip Christ. Dick novel. Like when they yeah. had the kid who was like, "I'm a normal kid," oh, although I'm a fucking robot. He's gonna kill yeah. you. Was, oh man yeah good, good movie yeah it was actually a really good movie so yeah uh watch this movie uh if you're a jude law fan definitely watch this movie if you're an Ed Ed Harris, Harris fan, fan ron perlman fan yeah rachel wise yeah. i don't know it's not her best performance but she definitely pulls it off so if you're a rachel wise fan um you can also watch this there's some rachel wise uh, potential rachel wise but in this uh, I think Bud it was Weiser. a doppelganger. Budweiser. I think it was a doppelganger. A, a real nice uh, bottle of Budweiser right, in, right there. So. Budweiser. <laughs> please, Budweiser. Please, we, we have to Budweiser. Make a, we, we, have, ah. we have a... We have Budweiser. Uh, Budweiser. No, I was like... <laughs> you know, like when, when we had a tour and, uh, last year and we were in uh, Prague. Yeah. Like on the last day before we left to Bratislava, there was a guy... Who, who like was handling ha- handing um flyers yeah and he was like oh come to this trip club you know do you want some uchi buchi uchi buchi <laughs> i was like well, really is it from like 1912 oh no no that was from like honky donkey you know no, that was straight from Clorics like oh, okay. uh, Jay and Simon Bob like yeah. you want to say Uchi Duchi oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. I, I remember yes. or, or Humpy Dumpy I don't know there's something like that like Sco- Uchi Sco- Buchi Scooch, like Uchi Scooch Mooch Scooch Mooch man yeah, yeah yeah something like that all right Dennis yeah thank you for being here um, plugs where can people find you um, oh okay uh, first of all Instagram yes. uh, at Russian uh, lower dash comedian russian comedian damn such Dennis a good Nicolin. such a good instagram yeah uh, i know i know i know, I, know. Prime I, always right post, I always post stuff oh, about about let's what happens. be honest 
the only guy who who else uh, would be eligible for this is Putin because he pranked whole nation. Ah. Man, I worked uh, I worked during the elections with the Associated Press, and it was. Yeah. Did you sorry. get an AP credit? Dude, we were on a Sunday night, where, like uh, when uh, the uh, pre-elections, uh, pre uh, so how do you call it? Premature. Pre premature <laughs> elections. That's when you just the result before you. Electuating, <laughs> electuating. <laughs> Before the actual electorating, yeah, you have yeah. Some when, when, Putin, when Putin had seventy-three uh, percent, and then two hours later, okay, final elections were results. Oh, you mean, uh, you mean uh, the statistics before? Yeah, that, yeah, like the, yeah. The, the yeah. Me, 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 and, my um, Bosnian yeah. cameraman. And by the way, I was hired to be just a translator for the camera guys, and I became a journalist <laughs> during those three days. And Smart. on Sunday night, we were on the Red Square. And there was a concert, and the Associated Press told us that it was the concert dedicated to the elections. Yeah. And we were like, okay, let's go, fuck it, let's film it. And we were there, and 30 minutes later, I realized it was not about the elections. It was about the annexion of the Crimea four years ago. I was like... So good. I told it to my cameraman, uh, like uh, the, the guy from Bosnia, the dire yeah. uh, film director from Bosnia, who actually sometimes works as a camera guy for Associated Press. Great guy, Elder. Fucking thank you, Hvala. And like he he he, he turned to me. And he was like, "Then what the fuck are we doing here?" <laughs> and we had what to, is our purpose? <laughs> and then we had to film the like the vo uh, the vox box. Uh, yeah. I had to take some some vox box. And we uh, took a couple of uh, female Russians and a couple of uh, male Russians. And one of the guys here, like the Russian and hat. And then you let them fight to the death. No, okay, yes. No, no, wait, wait. Like he had like a Russian hat, like a Russian coat, like a, a sign that I was on the elections and stuff. Yeah. And I asked him like, so what uh, do you think about the pre-elections results yeah. and why? And he's like, yeah, yeah, I like it. I love it because I voted for Putin. Because Putin is the one love for us. And he started crying. Wow. He started crying. And we were trying to get the fuck out of the Red Square Jesus. for 20 minutes. And like <laughs> I had the tripod. I had the tripod in my hands. Elder had like the, the camera in his hands. And we were trying to get through the crowd. I look in his eyes and I saw Sarajevo during the Yugoslavian wars. Like literally the flashbacks in his eyes. And we got through. He was like, man. That was some fucking shit. <laughs> Two things kept me sane that night. Yeah. First thing, I was on the job. I yeah. had to be professional. Professional. Sorry. Oh, wait. Just we had time. to be professionals. Yes. We had to be professional. Good people. Good people. Good people. And the second thing that I saw more people on Metallica concert. There were about three or four thousand people in the square. And trust me. I saw more people on the Metallica concert. Russian comedian also in Moscow. We do uh, stand up in English. Yes. Where English Moscow stuff, comedy. Yes. I'm a co founder with Igor Monday, the guy from Croatia. We are doing English stand up in Moscow. If you're in Moscow, check us out on 28th of April. We're having a big English stand up when? gala show when? 28th of April. Um, I think this is not going to be released before. Uh, like, this is going to be released in. In May? Like first week of May, probably, yeah. Anyhow, on 28th <laughs> of May, we had... 20th of May. Uh, sorry. 28th of April, yeah. You know, Russian propaganda. We, we always move, we always move the You had a great show that probably went no. amazingly and you sold out. Mm -hmm. You had to book another last show. Last year, last year. Yeah. Last year on the 1st of April, in, in the center of Moscow, in uh, a Soviet theater of Dom Kino, which is like uh, the Das Haus, mm -hmm. Der Kino, or... Yeah, the, the 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 house of cinema. Yeah. Yeah, we had five hundred people on our show on the first nice. of April. Yes, yes, and we are a fucking well, come on, we are fucking no names. But on twenty eighth of April, we will have had another. We will have had the sequel. Sweet. From Russia All with right. life. English Thank Moscow you. comedy, Russian comedian, Dennis Nicole and Paul, shut the fuck up. It's my turn. <laughs> boom. That was a great that was a great movie. And boom. Your links are in the description below. Yeah, check out of course all of the FFP. I'm stuff. in Vienna, I'm so excited. I was let in. That is so great. I was let out as well. Yes, probably. Um we will see that to that. <laughs> you I will wanna be stay. Let out. Just I wanna uh, this is for the record. I wanna stay. 
No, oh, that's that's fair enough. Vienna is pretty great. It's pretty sweet. Vienna's great. Yeah. Um, thank you guys for listening in, and see you the next time. Bye. See you the next time. Goodbye. Всего хорошего. Да. До свидания.